Is that right? Oh, baby. What's up, guys? This is Scooty, and welcome back to another episode of Our Survival Evolve on the Feudor server. How's everybody doing? Yes. I'm great. Is there food in my beard? Mrs. Hawkeye, what are you doing? Is there a worm on the floor? I mean, come on, girl. You are fixated like a mofo, aren't you? Oh, my goodness. <laughs> yes, everybody. Ha! Last episode, we... We... Took all the daunting task of making three industrial forges and holy crap they took a lot of supplies yes it did not only that guys i mean i <laughs> we crafted up a butt ton of uh, of metal and everything i just recently did a huge metal run um and let all that smelted up over the last hour look at that so that's already <laughs> five thousand over and then you got another 2300 over here and then this little bit that i've done over here as well so an extra 653 that my friends in my inventory is for today's episode oh i also been well i'll tell you what on the map what i've been doing in today's episode or before the day's episode is going around the map been collecting a lot of things and we're going to get into that right now my friends but i also took care of a few different um tech animals as well so we've been harvesting some of those every time i get a chance baby we shoot them up just like we shoot them in the subsistence series when it comes to the um what do you call those things yeah i better close this door the moose the moose in the subsistence series oh my gosh if you guys aren't watching that you need to it's quite fun and obviously in the co-op series man we're just having way too much sun okay all right so look at this oh my gosh we should have so much i don't even know how many of these uh giant bee or these beehives that we have you know gotten off camera um and look 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 we have so much stuff oh i don't want that right now that can actually stay over here but look at this we got an ascendant saddle armor rating of 73.9 a velanosaur yeah that's what that was <laughs> yeah i mean i'm always i'm i don't always stop for the drops but i do st stop from time to time let's go ahead and get some of that let's get some of that um let's go ahead and get some of these as well what is our weight up to uh uh yeah okay and then we'll just so what we're trying to do in today's episode is we're going to i want to kind of automate our cementing paste operation i mean right now guys i mean look there's there's really no reason for us to automate it but why not automate it why because we like i said there's really not a reason uh or a necessity to because of how much stuff we can actually get let's go ahead and put this over here and then drop this over here as well and this this crate yes because <coughs> we can go to the volcano <coughs> island or a lava island whatever you want to call it you're headed towards the door no you're not no you don't no you don't no you don't big guy just turn around and go the other way <laughs> and we can get so much chitin but obviously like i said using the chainsaw and killing centipedes and look this guy made a beeline for the freaking door didn't he i knew that was going to happen anyways so um <clears throat> we need to tame up some of the um oh shoot some of those snails i don't really know how to pronounce them which by the way i didn't know you could actually get in the redwood forest because i've crossed quite a few over there um there's a lot of beehives over there too um but i primarily run them to oh excuse me got the hiccups over in the swamp biome yeah oh, oh you got a little gyrating thing going on don't you big boy oh i've never seen those things up that way before now have i huh okay well let's see let's go ahead and take this and this and then we'll just, we're, we're, we will worry about the rest later do you i thought i had more rare flowers in this but i only have one one enough oh i knew it don't close it no <laughs> yeah you sucker get no yeah you you are not slick my friend so we should have enough um, to probably go ahead and craft one of these things. Can we craft one right now? 
beehive. Where do they got to be made? Anywhere. We just need thatch and fiber. Um, we should have... Well, there's plenty of thatch over here. For sure. So let's just take a look at this. So thatch and then we have plenty of fiber too. So let's go ahead and make a couple of these. We can only make one because... Oh no, we need 10 more honey. No, I know where to get some quick honey though. That, that That's a good thing. But let's take a look at where these things actually are. And we also need to get a crap ton of these rare flowers. These rare flowers are pretty easy to get too, but holy crap. Um, it's still... A, why is this taking so long to dang craft? Okay. This is an exceptionally friendly beehive. Produces honey and waters nearby crops. Oh yes, guys. So we've been collecting some of this beehive honey yes if we get five per i don't know if that's the usual thing or whatever i know taming rates are not taming rates but resource gathering rates is up a little bit so this is what we got this is six uh so one two three four five six so that's 36 and then we have 40. we have one more whoa wait wait what we need 50 for the beehive but that's what we're trying to get to obviously and um I didn't really do any kind of like low reading or anything for these things off camera. Um, but I I thought I had seen a lot of these uh, beehives over here in the... What is that? That's an Ascendant. I'll take it. Um, <coughs> sorry, guys. Um, so, yeah, I've seen... I thought I had located a lot of these beehives um, off camera at some point in time over here in the, in the Redwood Forest. And... So I decided to come over here and take a look at these things to see. And I've already found, like I said, that we're up to 36 of these things so far. And we need 50 for at least one beehive. That's going to get us one step closer to taming these little snails that we want to get. Um, I don't know if we'll be able to. Is that a jacket? Yeah, that is. What level are you, by the way? Old thatch monster. 25. I don't care about you. And here goes another one. Yes, like a boss. One more, baby. Holy crap, isn't this an interesting dam? I did not know this actually existed on this map. This is freaking crazy, dude. Look at this. This is amazing. Freaking cool. Uh, hell yeah. Love it. <laughs> we are still on the search. It looks like we only need one more honeybee or honey hive or beehive or whatever the heck so we can craft our own and oh my gosh one step closer to getting what the heck is that oh those are aloes yeah we'll be one step closer to getting a hold of those snails which means i guess we could just put it over here yeah uh seed master you're all up in my grill baby yeah i'll tell you what we'll just either of that we'll put them right here but yeah i want to get at least two maybe three of these things uh but harvesting the bee off camera oh my god it's not really a headache but i mean it took me over an hour just to get the 50 that i needed for one of these things so yeah i don't know if we're going to get three we're at least pushed towards four and we just crafted it domesticated beehive well let's see what this thing actually looks like can we oh my god this thing is gargantuan um should we put it right here sure why not so pick up a loud domesticated beehive. What does this thing do? Access inventory. What does this thing actually need? Provides. Provide where. Re, nah, provide where. Re, provide <laughs> rare flowers to keep bunny. Uh, bunny. Oh my God. Where's my English today, dude? <laughs> provide rare flowers to keep the high producing honey. Okay. Well, I have 16 right here for right now. So let's just go ahead and throw those in here. How many do these things of these things actually go by? Ooh. Now, I don't know if this is actually the best thing to be doing is keeping an actual honey hive or a beehive in the freaking um, inside, but this is a warehouse. You need to get up out of my way because you was trying to escape, you little slick fool, or at least you think you slick. Um, so how quick does this thing... Hmm. And how long does this thing actually take to provide honey? I don't know. We're going to find out. I'm going to go ahead and craft a second one real quick and just see where we can get... So it looks like we need 10 additional honey and we need uh, a metric buck ton of the rare flowers. Crap, here we go. On the search again. I'm going to be tired. All right, guys. So we should have enough materials to go ahead and make the other uh, the other two. 
beehives, I think. I'm hoping. Because <laughs> if not, we're going to be in a lot of damn trouble. Um, I took... Well, obviously, Cat went around the entire map once again. And then we took Fire out to go get some of these um, rare flowers. And everything else we should have in our inventory. Um, is it this one right here? I think it is. I think it was... Uh, pretty sure it was this. And it was thatch, I thought. We already have one, and look at this thing. This thing is actually already producing. It's producing fairly well. It's produced 12, and I don't know how long I've actually been gone, but man, oh man, oh man. All right, let's go ahead and make these other two real quick. I think it's beehive, right? Wait, no, that's not what we need to do. These things take forever to freaking craft, by the way. Look at that. Wait, what am I missing? No, we had it all. Did I not get all the honey? Pretty sure I didn't. No. Do I need to go get more honey for the second one? Oh man, for the third one rather. I thought I had enough for the third one. Well, how many how many honey do I have in here? So it's 12 and I have 1 2 3 4 5 and then 6 I have 10. So that's not too bad. Now I have 13. That's not too bad. We'll we'll make it happen. Oh, crap. What the heck? I had way more than I thought I needed. This game be cheating. All right, guys. We're back. I got some more crafting up this stupid thing. We had a few more honeys left over, but, you know, it is what it is. So we're going to go ahead and craft this last one. And it should give us our three in total. Yes, like a boss. Let's just put that one down there. Can we... Oh, is it not going to snap? Okay. Well, we're just going to have to make this happen then. Okay. And then put this one like so as well. Is that right? Oh, baby. Oh. And then we're going to have to split these. Well, actually, we need to split these by three, don't we? So let's put 94. And that one and that one. And then we're going to have to do another split job. So let's just put these in here. Yes. And then do this again, I guess. That should be just fine, right? And this should be all that we need, I'm hoping. Yeah, and then we can split this again. We'll make all the honey. And why are we doing this, guys? Well, I'll tell you exactly why. We need these... <coughs> these honeybees... These domesticated bunny highs. Bunny highs? They're out there. Said it again, dang it. Dude, bro, you need to get out of my way. I'm trying to record a video. Okay, let's just not. <laughs> we need to get these so we can get all these all the giant bee honey crafted up. And the reason why we need that is specifically for this sweet cake. So if you go in here to consumables, vegetables, this sweet vegetable cake, you need only two giant bee honey per mm hmm and this is gonna get us the ability to uh, go tame a couple I'm probably gonna do I don't know I'm at least thinking a handful so maybe between three and five of those giant snails and then I I'm gonna have to read up exactly how they work and that is gonna be the automation of our cementing paste far but anyways guys I do think that's going to be it for us in today's episode. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure you hit the thumbs up button. If you're new to the channel, feel free to subscribe. And as always, guys, I'll, we'll always catch you in the next episode. Peace out. <laughs> Bye.